A law that was supposed to better protect children getting on and off school buses in South Carolina is not doing any good because of the way it was written. The state lawmakers are trying to address that now. 7 News Capital reporter Robert Kittle tells us exactly what they need to do. School bus drivers see it all the time. The stop arm is out with lights flashing for students to get on or off the bus. But some drivers don't stop. Sharon Kemp now lives in South Carolina but lived in North Carolina in 2012. Her 12-year-old son Adam was about to get on the bus that October. As he stepped off the porch to cross over, a van not, uh, didn't stop and threw him 125 feet, and he died of a multi-system uh, trauma to his whole body. She was on the porch and saw it happen. Because of what she went through, she came to a state Senate subcommittee hearing on a bill to strengthen the state's law against illegally passing a stopped school bus. Here are some pretty incredible numbers. The state estimates that around 2,000 drivers illegally pass stop school buses every day in South Carolina. But because of the way the current law is, last year and this year, the Highway Patrol has written only two tickets for it based on video evidence. Current law says video like this can be used to issue a driver a ticket only if the driver is clearly identifiable. It's very difficult to get the driver's face due to uh, the sun glare, window tinting, so on and so forth. And, of course, in the mornings, you're not going to get anything before the sun comes up. This bill would allow the state to mail a ticket to the registered owner of a vehicle, regardless of who's driving. The subcommittee passed the bill, but it has very little chance of becoming law this year. Supporters are hoping it still might, or this will speed up the process next year. I think everyone should be made aware of what could happen if they don't stop. In Columbia, Robert Kittle, 7 News. Yeah, so get this, despite that law, the commander of the Highway Patrol says about the only way for them to write tickets for failing to stop for a school bus is to have a trooper witness it. He says in four years, the Highway Patrol has only written 126 tickets for failing to stop at a school bus.